My name is Brian Moore. I'm a Vice President of Facilities Management doing Program Management for Union Bank. And when we first were uh, entertaining the idea of uh, life cycle asset management, uh, we ended up looking at various options on how to implement it. And one of the big concerns was how do we collect all this data and how we do it in a reasonable amount of time. So we looked initially at our facility managers and mobile engineers and thought about uh, using them and the data acquisition uh, component. We also looked at uh, architectural and MEP firms. We have some that are associated with our particular admin facilities and they know those facilities really well and would be able to do a pretty good job. Uh, but the problem there is also inconsistency. The, the people we have down south are, do things slightly differently than the people up north. And we also had the uh, potential of scaling. How do they do really small sites? Uh, we have a, 400 properties that are on the average of about 7,500 square feet. And having a, an architect, a mechanical, an electrical, and a plumbing person come out for those sites wasn't reasonable in terms of costs. There was also the potential that um, there would be a conflict of interest uh, with those parties as they might drive more work uh, that would be headed to them uh, since they were dedicated to facilities. So then we ended up deciding on VFA because we could get uh, the same team to come out and be able to do the properties. So we had two teams that did admin facilities and they were very consistent uh, working uh, together to make sure the data was consistent for the admin facilities. And they were able to set up uh, models in advance uh, for our retail sites. And we had small teams that went out and collected the information on the retail sites. And that ended up being very cost effective uh, because VFA was able to scale with our, our, our properties. So the larger properties had four people on them, moderate properties might have two people. And at the retail sites, they had a special uh, a, a person that was non specials that could do all four of the components at the same time. And that ended up giving us a very good cost and uh, the ability to implement on a rapid scale.